As the Chicago Bears took to the field today in their final game of the NFL season, a development group released a new dramatic six minute video of proposed stadium renovations in an effort to keep the Bears playing at Soldier Field. As fans file out of Soldier Field on another beautiful football Sunday, the future of the Bears stadium hangs in the balance. It'd be cool if they stayed because, you know, it's Soldier Field. It's right on the lake. It's a classic. Today, Landmark Development released a new video of what Soldier Field could look like in a complete redevelopment. The reimagined stadium showcasing a glass dome for usage all year round, more skyboxes, clubs and lounges, and more stadium seating. Plus, across the street, an entertainment district with concert space and a new transit hub called One Central Station. Honestly, I can't imagine going out to Arlington Heights to watch Bears games. The city of Chicago throwing a Hail Mary with the proposed renovation to persuade the Bears to stay after the team announced it entered into a purchase agreement with Arlington Heights for the site of the former Arlington International Racecourse. There is nothing like coming downtown for Bears game. If they decide to move, I definitely go to games. Something dramatically different uh, has to happen. The, the Bears have to do something. The building is just efficient, really, by all the measurables that we use in sports today. Transportation, fan experience, uh, e even the simple things like ingress, egress. The lead developer for Lambeau Field, Ford Field, U.S. Bank Stadium, and MetLife Stadium, Robert Dunn with Landmark Development, believes they can change that. We believe there's a case that there is no building that matches it in the National Football League, and there's certainly no other site in Chicago. In a statement, a spokesperson for the team says, quote, the only potential project the Chicago Bears are exploring for a new stadium development is Arlington Park. Now, if the Bears decide not to stay at Soldier Field, Landmark Development says there are plans to still renovate the stadium on a smaller scale. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.